It is just around the corner, less than two weeks before Halloween. If you have not gotten costumes for the kids yet, it's not too late. Don't worry. News 13's Catherine Mazone looked into how you can stretch your dime to get a costume for less. She joins us live with all the details. Good morning, Catherine. Good morning, Crystal. Halloween costumes can be pricey, let's face it. Ordering online could be a cheaper alternative, but then you have more factors to consider, like shipping costs and delivery dates. We looked into how you can save money with a little creativity. Check it out. Double, double, toil and trouble. Fire, burn and cauldron bubble. It's hard to ignore the Halloween spirit. You look good enough to especially with decorations plastered in nearly every store. But between candy and decorations, costs can really add up. It's why some parents are opting out of buying pre-made costumes and hitting low-cost stores to see what they can create themselves. We get a lot of people coming through and just making their own kind of costumes. Uh, everybody's trying to do their uh, do-it-yourself kind of thing. Savers employee Melkor Quesada sees parents' creativity firsthand. It's really nice to see what they customers come up with and what they put together because sometimes I'm kind of like, oh, why didn't I think of that? He helped us put together a few of our own low price costumes. This pirate top is only five bucks. These pants, only three dollars. Throw in these shoes and this hat and you have a pirate costume. The total cost, about twenty dollars. But without shoes, it's only fifteen. Now compare that to online stores and suddenly the prices go up. We found a few pirate costumes for under $30, but scroll down and this one will cost you nearly 80. While several big box stores have costumes at even lower prices, keep an eye out. Some are already out of stock. It's why it should come as no surprise, many parents are bucking the online trend. In fact, according to the National Retail Federation, the vast majority of people say they plan to buy their costumes in a store. Now they're running around and checking everything out and they have ideas of what they want to be. Some parents we spoke to say they go early to try to avoid long lines in packed stores. As for what's hot this year, Quesada says... I've seen a lot of girls do the 50s themes. For boys? All about like the superheroes. Um, they like to make their own little versions of it. Um, I've seen kids like mix up uh, our uh, astronaut costume and make a Buzz Lightyear. And if you really want to stretch your buck, some parents we spoke to say they just plan to reuse costumes from years past. We checked a few big box stores and found if the costume you want is in stock, you can still get it before Halloween. Standard shipping gets your costume here by about the 27th. If you pay a little extra, though, you can get it by the 21st. Back to you, Crystal. All right, thanks so much, Catherine. Now, we found you can also score some deals if you're an Amazon Prime member. According to Amazon, you can still receive your costume before Halloween. That's if you order today. So get on it.